how to create an endless scrolling background in Scratch. These have insanely wide applications in pretty much every single game. The purpose of this is to just give an illusion that the player is moving forward. For this effect, you will need a background that encompasses and covers the entire costume editor. I'll use this geometry dash background. Just note that this background needs to look good next to itself, otherwise the result of this is not going to be too pretty. Anyway, here's how you can code this into existence. We will use two variables. The first is called background x. The second variable is called clone id and we will make sure to set it for this sprite only. Let me quickly explain what we will do. We will have two different clones while the sprite itself will be invisible. One of the clones will be positioned at the center. The second clone on the other hand will be positioned extremely to the right. As the game goes on, we will move both the clones in unison leftwards until the first clone is completely off the screen. After this, before a single frame, we will move both the clones to their right by the stage width. This can just go on again and again and again, giving us a seamless animation. Back to the code. Set both background x and clone id to be 0. Then create a clone. After this, change clone id by 1 and then create another clone. This way, the first clone will have a clone id of 0, while the second clone has a clone id of 1. Hide and within a forever loop, check if background x is negative 480. If yes, then set it to 0. Outside the condition, increment background x by minus 1. In essence, this will create two distinguishable clones and have a background x variable that will loop repeatedly from 0 to negative 480. Now we just have to move the clones in accordance with the variables. So when a clone is created, within a forever loop, set the size to 400, then go to x, background x plus 480 times clone id, y0, and finally set the size back to 100. The changes in size that we're doing back and forth is to fix a common scratch bug that relates to stage fencing. Anyway, with this, you should have an endless scrolling background. This is quite nice, but in some cases, we might want the background to move a little bit faster. Not a problem, because this can be added with just a small modification. In the main forever loop, instead of changing background x by minus 1, change it by something like minus 2 or minus 3. And that's it, this should increase the speed of the animation. Like I said before, this has countless applications, so feel free to customize the same. 